Welcome to Pittsburgh. Located at the confluence of the Monongahela, Allegheny, and Ohio Rivers, the city lies at the foothills of the Appalachian Mountains. Nicknamed the City of Bridges and the Steel City, it's increasingly defined by its thriving economy, scientific and medical innovation, and continuous influx of ideas, people, business, and culture. Ranked as one of the most livable and affordable cities in the United States, it has 88 unique neighborhoods. The major industries within the city range from healthcare and biomedical research to engineering and the arts. As a result, it has become a magnet for technology startups and established corporate giants such as Westinghouse, Google, and Bayer. A large portion of Pittsburgh's economical success has been attributed to the city's numerous educational institutions. The Oakland neighborhood, in particular, is the educational and research center of the city. Located in Oakland, Carnegie Mellon University, commonly known as CMU, is one of the main contributors transforming the city into a leader in digital and scientific ingenuity. Consistently highly ranked, the university stands as a beacon for leadership and academic achievement. Founded by industrialist and steel tycoon Andrew Carnegie in 1900, Carnegie Technical Institute merged with the Mellon Institute of Industrial Research in 1967 to become the Carnegie Mellon University we know today. The graduate student population forms a large and important part of the campus community. There are approximately 5,400 graduate students in over 60 academic programs. At other schools which I interviewed at, the graduate students were a minority in the lab and postdocs or undergrads were actually the people who did the bulk of the work and the bulk of the thinking. At Carnegie Mellon, um, many labs do have a postdoc or two, but all of the labs have multiple graduate students and those are really the people who are pushing the research forward, who are discovering the information. You wind up with a very close connection with your PI. The excellence in higher education, young urban culture, cost of living, and accessible housing are some of the factors that attract students from all over the world to attend graduate school in the city. Pittsburgh's a great place to come and live as a graduate student because it has um, a really high standard of living but a low cost of living. So it's very affordable to live here as a graduate student. With approximately 95 doctoral and master's students, the Department of Biological Sciences fosters a close-knit and collaborative environment. The department is housed in the Mellon Institute, which is roughly a 10-minute walk from the main campus. Close to the Mellon Institute is the popular South Craig Street Business District, where students and faculty gather to study and socialize. Within walking distance is the cultural heart of Oakland with Carnegie Museums of Art and Natural History, the Phipps Conservatory and Botanical Gardens, Carnegie Music Hall, and Carnegie Library of Pittsburgh. Many graduate students reside in Oakland in the surrounding neighborhoods of Shadyside, Squirrel Hill, Bloomfield, Friendship, Lawrenceville, and Regent Square because of the close proximity to campus. These neighborhoods provide various housing options such as lofts, apartments, townhouses, and condominiums and are all located near public transportation, shopping venues, and restaurants. So I currently live in the neighborhood called Squirrel Hill and one thing I like about it is that it's so peaceful. Plus, it's close to all the major shops you could ever, you would ever need, such as grocery stores, restaurants, everything. Everything along Marie, it's just packed with crowds, which just makes it bustling. Downtown Pittsburgh is the hub of the city's cultural district, including the Benetton Center and Heinz Hall. It offers a wide variety of music, visual art, and theater entertainment. The city also contains the largest single artist museum in the country, the Andy Warhol Museum. Besides cultural interests, the city boasts numerous outdoor activities. Kayaking, canoeing, and boating are a few popular activities on the rivers. An intricate rail-to-trail system also follows the rivers and provides scenic views for cyclists, walkers, runners, or rollerbladers. Surrounding the trail are significant landmarks, including Carnegie Science Center, Heinz Field, and PNC Park. Other shopping, dining, theater going, and nightlife entertainment can be found at the Waterfront, Southside Flats, and Station Square. Numerous graduate students frequent these areas, which are just a short bus trip away. Passengers can board the Monongahela and Duquesne inclines at Station Square and ride to the top of Mount Washington. The view of the city and three rivers from the observation decks on Mount Washington has been ranked one of the most beautiful views in America. It's definitely one of the best spots to watch the city's 4th of July fireworks. In addition to the thrill of fireworks, Pittsburgh offers the excitement of amusement parks. Kennywood, a national historic landmark, is known for its classic wooden roller coasters, games, food, and charm. 
For all of the outdoor enthusiasts, the western Pennsylvania terrain provides numerous hiking and camping trails. The Carnegie Mellon Graduate Student Assembly hosts various skiing, river rafting, and camping trips throughout the year. And for the more adventurous individuals, skydiving, snowboarding, extreme biking, and rock climbing locations can be found within an hour of the city. Pittsburgh's people, strong work ethic, and attractions make it one of the best kept secrets in America. When combined with Carnegie Mellon's leadership in research and academics, it creates a perfect environment for intellectual and cultural pursuits. We look forward to seeing you on campus.